Do you want to go to Europe? Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. We're Simon and Maddie. In this series, we'll be going to some of the most beautiful places in the world. How good is it? So join us on our six week adventure through Europe. Get ready to delve into the charm of Christmas markets, dance into the new year on the lively streets of Budapest, marvel at extraordinary cathedrals and historic castles. This looks like a real castle. Witness the world's most famous artworks and monuments, Tick one of the wonders of the world off our bucket list, embrace the magic of snow-capped mountains, and of course, indulge in the delicious food that Europe has to offer. This is so good. Yummy. This is a journey that you won't want to miss, so let the European exploration begin. In this series, we'll be including bloopers, so make sure you watch until the end. Welcome, Welcome to, to Paris. Paris. How exciting, we're here. So we're going to our accommodation now. We can't check in yet, but we're going to Drop our luggage and then we're gonna start the day. Yep. Welcome to our home for the next four days. In Paris. <laughs> and this actually feels like Paris. Look at these windows. I know when we're at the airport, we were saying like, oh does it feel like Paris yet? I'm like, mm, not yet. And then we're on the train and we're like, oh does it feel like Paris? Oh not yet. But this feels like Paris. We've got our bed right there. Pretty cool. Yep, a little, um, what's it called, mezzanine, and then into the bathroom. Just got some breakfast. Oven first croissant. It's very humbling when you try and order in French, and then they speak English back to you. Mm -hmm. I said, un croissant, it's the same. Hopefully. Best croissant I've ever had, and it's, not, it's not even warm. It's hot. So we just tried to get into St. Chapel without our ticket. What happens? We're waiting there for an hour and we didn't move anywhere. Alright, so we've booked an entry ticket to St. Chapel. I'm guessing when we get there we're still going to have to wait in line. Um, yeah, but at least we will get in this time. Yeah, there were people like who booked for 10 and they were getting in at 10.30. Like, like, yeah, a bit behind so. Yeah, but so we saw the um, Notre Dame. Notre Dame. Still under construction. but. Looks pretty nice from the outside. Yeah. So, to be honest, when we first walked in, it was like the first section, and I thought that, that was it. Like, I thought, first room you're like. And I was like, oh, that's good. Like it was good, so I was like, oh, you know. And then yeah, we went to the next bit, and then that was like, wow. Wow. <laughs> Seriously? Um, this one is like a copy of the one in Rome. Yeah. The Rome one is like the first one, and then the French one of the Bill another one. Yeah. Bill one just like that. Now we're in the Pantheon. It's pretty amazing. Sure. Like all the architecture, all like all those details. What's all the painting on the wall? It's a piece, a piece, yep, a piece of history. I think. Yeah. Like every small, tiny detail, all the curves, all like the intricate little. Yeah, it's just it's amazing. Yep. But um, it was built in the 1700s. Yeah, um, the first woman though. So, like, there's um, a lot of prominent writers. French writers. Yeah. 
were buried here, but the first woman wasn't buried here until 1995 or something. Used to be a church, that's a fun fact. Yep, and it was also modelled after the Rome Pantheon. Mm -hmm. Well, we're checking that out as well and we'll see which one's better. How good is this view at the Pantheon? Mm -hmm. You're blocking the Eiffel Tower. No, I'm not. It's, it's right there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, we finish up at the Pantheon. Now we're at the Luxembourg Garden. Yep. And, and what else got we got? Four macarons. Yep. Um, French macarons. The guy said we had to wait five minutes because they're a bit cold, so mm -hmm. we had to wait five minutes to eat them. Yep. So we'll walk around the garden, wait five minutes, and we'll do a, and taste, do a test. taste test. Luxembourg Palace. Ta-da! There it is, right there. How's this on, mate? You need to do that for Simon. There's a chair. Ready? Go do it. <laughs> yeah. No, not not that far away. Yep. Angry-ish. Not angry, like, I don't know. That's good. Look at this chair. Like, this chair is... It's literally here for someone to do the same pose. That's what the chair is for. Um, I'm gonna go strawberry. Mmm. Mmm. That's cool. Mm -hmm. This is the coconut flavor. Mmm. So good. I'm not a sweet person and I like this. That tells you something. <laughs> yeah. We're walking to the Muse d'Orsay. Yep. It's one of the museums. One, yep. of the, one of the more famous ones. Yep, so what have we done? We went to the Saint Chapel. We yep, Saint Chapel. Went to um, um, Latin quarters. The um, Notre Dame. Yep. The Pantheon. Pantheon, yep. Um, the Luxembourg Gardens. Yep. Got some macarons. Mm -hmm. Now we're just walking along Paris Street. I wanted to talk about some things that I've noticed in Paris. So I've noticed that it's kind of dirty, um, just like some rubbish and like graffiti and stuff. I've noticed that lots of people smoke. Um, lots of people walk really fast. Like we're in a big rush, and so far I've felt pretty safe. Like, haven't felt like I'm gonna get pickpocketed or scammed or anything. Not yet. Um, but we'll we'll see tomorrow. You know what's up ahead? What? What is that? That's Whistler's mother from Mr. Bean's movie. Uh. Is he? Where can you find Maddie in the museum? Find the cows. Cows and then dogs. Bonjour, Bonjour and good morning. And good morning. It might not look like it, but it is the no, morning. It's like seven. Oh, it's like eight o'clock now. The sun rises at like eight thirty or something. Yep. But um, we booked the Louvre for nine, nine o'clock. Mm -hmm. It's actually not that far away from our um, Airbnb. It's like a twenty-minute walk. We thought um, 
we head there early, mm -hmm. beat the crowd, yep. take e some even, photos as well. Even though you're booked and you've got your time slot, there's a whole group of people who also have that time slot, so you still have to line up and wait. Yep. Because there'll be a whole, even though, yeah, we're nine o'clock, it's a whole big group of nine o'clock people. All right, took a bit of a wrong turn, literally a wrong turn, and I, but I think we're here. Wow. So grand. Big, eh? Hey? Yeah. Feel so small standing here. Oh, wow. Wow. So it's 8.30 in the morning. There's barely anyone at the Louvre. about quarter two. At 8.30 there were barely yeah. anyone now. We had a few good shots with like, yeah. no one in it, which was great. Mm -hmm. so this, 9 is, this is 10 minutes before they open. So we're here going at the straight, Louvre. Straight to the Mona. Everyone's going to the Mona. Straight up. They don't even care about anything else. There she is. Where is she? There she is, right in there. <coughs> so we saw Mona, we got right to the front. Yeah. And so now we're just going to go and look at every single thing that we skipped. Oh wow, look in. Oh wow. Simon, look in here. Oh my. Wow. I don't even think the camera can capture this. That is incredible. I honestly, I don't know how they do this. It's so. It's so intricate. I'm gonna have a sore neck. <laughs> so intricate and so beautiful. If you haven't noticed, I'm on a bike. We're both on bikes. Yeah, we're both on. A, just got on an e-bike. Mm -hmm. So how was that? That was probably the most stressful thing I have ever done. Riding a bike in Paris. That was. Oh, I think it was alright. It was kind of stressful no, every now and then. I, I said some explicit words, some f words. Like we were riding with the cars. Yes. The cars. I think it was really fun. I think some of the places as well, the cars were riding. Yeah, yeah, because they. Be yeah, exactly. Yeah. They are on the bike lane. Yeah. That's why. Sorry, uh. I've got to go again. It was <laughs> messed up. Yep. So now we're gonna grab some lunch and then head to the the opera. opera. Not watching. We're opera. All, yeah, we're just going in and checking out the building. Yeah. Um, but yeah, what an experience.
what? <laughs> you are kidding. When you think you can't get any better? To the Christmas tree. No, and then we got oh. this. <laughs> I hope the camera turned out as good as what we're seeing right now. If you're in Paris, you have to go there. The opera is a must see. Like, Incredible. Yep. Like, no words. Like you, you turn into um, Owen Wilson. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. 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 So we didn't end up getting lunch. So now, we're now going we're going out. to find something. Looks like there's like a restaurant and cafe over there. Yeah. Alright, let's go. Ten hours later. It's good, hey. Good. Yep. It's really good. Now we also have frog legs. That's good. Good. Chicken. Yeah, it does. Oh, they all taste like chicken, apparently. <laughs> so, fun fact I love snails. Uh, and frog legs. Yeah. I don't know if I like, I like frog legs, but like, I love snails. <laughs> oh, yeah. Now we're trying to find a bike so we can go to the Art de Triomphe. So, I can put myself through that stress all over again. Yep. Speak Louis. Louis who? What are we looking at? A big suitcase or a big makeup case or something. And how was that ride? That was much better because we had a designated spot with barricades along the side so cars could come in and get us. Yep. So that was much better. And driving straight towards us, straight is the Arc de Triomphe. Oh, right here. Wow. How's this? So this is sunset hour? In Paris. In Paris. You know what's there? Everyone's in front of it. It must be the Eiffel Tower. So we're gonna stay here until 7. Watch it sparkle. Watch the Eiffel Tower sparkle. So in the meantime, we'll get some food. <coughs> so what happened? Um, so we ordered some chips, some tenders, a beer and a hot chocolate. So this is apparently hot chocolate. <laughs> what did you say? I said hot chocolate and then he said something back. I said, yeah. 
French version of hot chocolate. Well, what's they... that potato? Is it? Yeah, it looks like potato bait. Anyway, look at look at our view. I don't know about this. This is my safety line. Who's gonna save you? Who's gonna make you? After admiring the sparkling Eiffel Tower, we wrapped up the night exploring our first Christmas market at Jardin de Tuileries. <laughs> it's got ran over by a train. Alright, what? Damn, Dom. Why'd you have to do that? Oh, truck, truck just came through. We were here getting photos of the swan, and then someone goes, oh, What's that? <laughs> flicks! And flicks it onto me. Bird poo. 